Okay, a lot of people has been asking for this video on how to get voice mod to work with Steel Series Sonar. So I'm gonna cover this video. It's gonna be real short, not a super long video, but there's some things you need to know about it. And I'll talk about a couple little things you might need to be aware about if you have certain setups. So I'm gonna go through that. But first, let's talk about our video sponsor, Own.TV. Are you a noob like me when it comes to making graphics for your live stream? Well, that's why own.tv is there. They give you stream packages such as the minimal series, which gives you everything that you need to build your live stream, including customizing your own Twitch profile. Now I'm going to be using this in my next series of tutorials for OBS studio. So if you're interested, then definitely make sure you watch those videos, but listen, I'm gonna provide a link down in the description below and a 50% off code using code TFS that you can use to purchase your stream packages. I appreciate own.tv for sponsoring this video. Okay, so the first thing that you're gonna to wanna to do to get this set up is you're gonna to wanna to bring up voice mod. Then you're gonna to wanna to go to settings and under input, you're going to want to select the actual microphone you're gonna use. In my case, I'm using the Wave 3 microphone from Elgato. The output here doesn't really matter in terms of sonar, but I have selected the output to my focus right. That's where my headphones are currently plugged into. As far as setting up, that's all you need to do for voice mod. When you go to bring up Steel Series uh, sonar, you'll go to your mixer settings, and for your microphone input, you're going to want to select voice mod virtual audio device WDM microphone there. So this is the microphone uh, that voice mod generates that you can use. So this will bring in those voice effects into Steel Series Sonar. From that, what you're going to want to do is for all of your different softwares, whatever you're going to use your microphone, you want to set up the Steel Series microphone. So here I have OBS, you go under properties, and here you see, see Steel Series Sonar microphone and this is the virtual audio device that it creates. So that is going to be the microphone you actually use throughout all your different apps and everything, anything that you want the voice mod audio going to. So once you do that, then you should be able to go in and start using effects. So here, let me bring up voice mod and I will then go to the voice box. And let's change this to custom pitch. So yeah, you should now hear my voice change to this effect. Uh, here is a baby effect. Here is a Titan kind of Thanos sounding effect. So you got all these different ones that you can use. This actual one I was just just using to you know discuss how to set everything up. It's this new voice enhancer one that Voice Mods just added in, which is real nice. Here's Spellcaster. This is also a new one that they've added. It's a really cool different effects that you can have here. But that is really how you set everything up and you should be able to use it just fine. There is one issue that I had when doing this setup and that was headphone monitoring. So in certain different headphone monitors that I use, whether it's this Wave 3 or like my Beacon mic, I was having these issues where I was hearing this kind of popping sound in my monitor audio. I switched over to my focus right and listened to the output there and everything sounded clear. So that's something to be aware is you may have an issue where you're hearing this popping sound in your audio. That doesn't necessarily mean that the actual sonar virtual microphone that you're going to use throughout your different softwares has that popping sound, but it's just your earphone monitor. So be aware of that. Like right now you're listening to it and it's perfectly clear. So keep that in mind. Other than that though, Listen, if you want more information about how to use Sonar in various setups, then watch this video right here. 